There are several new Virginia laws going into effect in the new year, including one for children with hearing loss. DC News Now's Haley Mylon has more on how the bill passed will help save hundreds of dollars for so many families. Right, health insurance providers will be required to cover the cost of hearing aids for children, which experts say is a move that could avoid a lot of troubles down the road. When you don't hear, you start kind of withdrawing and isolating, and that affects the child's social development too. Dr. Pinky Cotri of Family Hearing Services in Fairfax County says hearing loss in children can lead to language delays and learning deficits. You're not able to hear the teacher, especially if there's a group discussion, people are talking all around, then with that noise, and different conversations, it's hard to focus. She sees many young patients in her practice and even brought a pediatric specialist onto her staff. It's pricey stuff. We've seen some parents kind of wait because they're not able to afford something for their children. Forbes reports the average cost of a pair of hearing aids in the U.S. is $4,000. The consequences of not getting the care perhaps even more costly. See the kids struggle through whether it's language development or if it's an older child through school, because it does affect academics. Senate Bill 1003 requires all health insurance providers to cover costs up to $1,500. Katri says it'll be a win for young patients. But the sooner you start, then we see how well their language is developed, they kind of match with their peers, and they do well. We hear from the parents saying they're doing so much better in school. Other changes include more counselors being eligible to practice in Virginia and new transparency requirements for your health insurance providers. From our Northern Virginia Bureau, I'm Haley Mylon, DC News Now.